As we gaze out into the vast expanse beyond our planet, we are reminded of just how small and insignificant we are in the grand scheme of things. Our universe is incredibly vast, and we are just a tiny dot within it. However, this vastness also harbors dangers that we must be aware of. Just recently, NASA warned us of a big threat, a massive asteroid that is heading straight for Earth. How big is it? And when can we expect it? Is another impact on the horizon? Let's find out. Asteroids are fascinating objects that have captivated both scientists and the general public. These relatively small rocky or metallic bodies are remnants of our solar system's formation. They are thought to have formed from the debris left over after the formation of the planets. Asteroids formed approximately 4.6 billion years ago when a cloud of gas and dust collapsed under its own gravity to form the Sun. The remaining dust and gas in the surrounding disk began to coalesce into larger and larger objects as the newly formed Sun heated up and began to emit light and energy. These objects collided and merged over time to form the planets we know today, as well as a plethora of smaller objects that became asteroids. There are currently around 822,000 known asteroids. However, astronomers believe that there are many more undiscovered asteroids out there. New ones are discovered all the time, and their orbits are constantly tracked by astronomers all over the world. Asteroids come in a variety of shapes and sizes, ranging from tiny rocks to massive objects that are hundreds of kilometers across. Some of the largest asteroids, such as Ceres, Vesta, and Pallas, are thought to be remnants of failed planets that were never able to form due to the gravitational influence of Jupiter. Astronomers are particularly fascinated by asteroids whose orbits bring them dangerously close to Earth. These so-called near-Earth asteroids can pose a potential threat to our planet if they were to collide with us. Indeed, evidence of such collisions can be found in the numerous craters that dot our planet. The most well-known example is the asteroid impact that is thought to have wiped out the dinosaurs around 66 million years ago. This impact was caused by an asteroid with a diameter of about 10 kilometers, and its effects were felt all over the world. Aside from being potentially hazardous, asteroids have the potential to provide valuable information about the early solar system. Because asteroids are remnants of our solar system's formation process, studying them can help us better understand how the planets formed and evolved over time. Scientists have even sent spacecrafts to study asteroids up close, such as the Japanese Hayabusa 2 spacecraft, which recently collected samples from the asteroid Ryugu. In the past, on July 25, 2019, an asteroid passed dangerously close to our planet, which was discovered by the Zwicky Transient Facility, a robotic camera that surveys the night sky for transient objects. The asteroid, dubbed 2019 OK, was only discovered a few days before its close approach, and its speed was estimated to be around 24 kilometers per second. If it had collided with Earth, it could have released energy equivalent to several nuclear bombs and cause widespread destruction. Another meteor made headlines in February of 2013. The Chelyabinsk meteor was one of the largest asteroid explosions in modern history. The meteor entered the Earth's atmosphere and exploded at about 30 kilometers altitude. The explosion created a shockwave that shattered windows, collapsed roofs, and injured people hit by flying glass and debris. The energy released by the explosion was estimated to be equivalent to approximately 500 kilotons of TNT, which is more than 30 times the power of the 1945 atomic bomb dropped on Hiroshima. NASA has just issued a warning that a massive asteroid is heading straight for Earth. This asteroid is currently speeding through space at a mind-boggling 21.78 kilometers per second, or approximately 63 and a half times the speed of sound. According to NASA, an asteroid traveling at this speed would produce more energy than 1,000 nuclear bombs. Because of their high velocity, even relatively small asteroids can cause significant damage. While NASA is constantly monitoring the movement of asteroids, there is still some uncertainty about when and where this particular asteroid will hit the planet. This is because asteroids can be unpredictable and their paths can be influenced by various factors like gravitational forces from nearby planets. 
Apophis, a potentially hazardous asteroid, has also been on the radar of space agencies around the world. Apophis is expected to pass within 19,000 miles of Earth on April 13, 2029, which is closer than the orbits of some of our geosynchronous satellites. This asteroid, which measures approximately 168 feet in width, is classified as potentially hazardous asteroid PHA because it may pose a threat to our planet. It is said to be one of the largest and nearest PHAs known to us. When it passes Earth, the asteroid is expected to travel at a speed of about 67,000 miles per hour, or about 30 kilometers per second. This is nearly 100 times faster than the speed of sound. Astronomers at Arizona's Kitt Peak National Observatory discovered Apophis in 2004. The asteroid was named after the ancient Egyptian god of chaos and destruction, which was a fitting name given its potential to cause harm to our planet, and it has been a topic of interest ever since. Initially, scientists believed that it could collide with Earth in 2029, which would have had catastrophic consequences. Further observations and calculations, however, have ruled out this possibility, and it's now believed that the asteroid will pass by our planet harmlessly. Apophis's close approach in 2029 will pass within the range of some of our geosynchronous satellites, making it visible to the naked eye for several hours. Despite this, there is still some concern about the future impact of Apophis on our planet. The asteroid is expected to pass close on Earth again in 2068, and while the chances of it colliding with us are still low, it cannot be completely ruled out. Aside from PHAs, astronomers are also interested in New Earth Objects, or NEOs. These are objects larger than 460 feet in diameter that come within 30 million miles of our planet. The good news is that the majority of known asteroids that could pose a threat to Earth have been mapped and their orbits have been calculated with great precision. The Center for Near-Earth Object Studies at NASA is constantly updating its database of near-Earth objects, providing early warning of potential asteroid impacts and assisting in the prevention of catastrophic events. Asteroid collisions are among the most destructive events that can occur on our planet. Although these events are extremely rare, they can have disastrous consequences, as the extinction of the dinosaurs indicated. As a result, space agencies such as NASA are working hard to track and monitor potentially dangerous asteroids, as well as develop methods to deflect them. Detecting and tracking these celestial bodies as they move through space is one of the primary ways scientists are attempting to prevent asteroid impacts. They can predict their trajectory and determine whether they pose a threat to Earth by doing so. If a potentially hazardous asteroid is discovered, space agencies can take action to deflect it and reduce the risk of an impact. A kinetic impactor is one of the proposed methods for deflecting an asteroid. This method entails crashing a spacecraft into an asteroid to alter its trajectory. The idea is that by doing so, the asteroid will be deflected and no longer pose a threat to Earth. This approach has already been tested by NASA in the Double Asteroid Redirection Test DART mission. A gravity tractor is another method of deflecting asteroids. This method involves putting a spacecraft near an asteroid and gradually changing its trajectory due to the asteroid's gravitational pull. While this method takes longer than using a kinetic impactor, it is less destructive and can be used to deflect asteroids of any size. Despite advances in detecting and deflecting potentially dangerous asteroids, there is still much work to be done. We hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe, like the video, and watch these ones as well.